<clears throat> Hold on. Sore, but uh, be all right. Are you okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm okay. I've been through worse. Jesus, how fucked up is that to think, huh? Listen, Alex, my systems are acting up a little, so I've got to get checked out. But if you want to meet or what? No, 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 I'm fine, man. You can just take care of you. This girl's built tough. Give me a call when you're useful again, okay? Talk to you soon. Open blinds. Good morning, Adam. You have one new message. From? David Sarah. <sighs> Play it. Adam, it's David. I know it's been a while, but uh, after what happened in Prague yesterday... Look, son, whatever reasons you've had for not getting in touch these last two years, well, life's too short. I'm leaving for London, but uh, give me a call. <coughs> you saved his vidcom number? Yes, Adam. Just activate your TV system. Out of sight, out of mind. to keep to myself. I'm surprised you even know I'm here. Interpol called me when you applied for the job. Are there extensive background checks? 
I gave you a glowing recommendation. Thanks. What do you want? What do I want? Jeez, Adam! I know I did some questionable things in the past, but a lot's happened in the last two years. To both of us. That's true. For what it's worth, I'm glad you made it out of Panchea. Thank you. It wasn't easy, as I'm sure you know. I was at death's door by the time the rescue crews pulled me out of the wreckage, and while the doctors were stitching me back together, my company fell apart. There wasn't anything I could do to stop it, not from a hospital bed. I heard Tai Young Medical bought everything up. They're the only biotech corporation that could, after the incident. Our patents, our tech, everything. Oh well, sometimes one dream has to die so another can rise from its ashes. You talked to Pritchard lately? Frank! <laughs> Out of all of us, I think he's the one who's changed the least. He'd probably tell you there wasn't anything about him that needed changing. I'm sure he would. But when the world transforms itself the way ours has, people need to adapt or get left behind. Frank's freelance now, but he's still in computer security, still in Detroit. I don't know if he'll ever leave. Yeah, what, what the hell with Megan? You heard anything from Megan? <sighs> After all we went through, I thought she'd stand by me. Still, you know, she always wanted to be at the cutting edge. She didn't see a future for herself in Detroit, so she went to Versa Life. She moved to Hong Kong? San Francisco. They've got an offshore research facility there named Rokaseka Beach. I'm sure you've seen it in the news. California, huh? I wonder if she's told her mother. You want my advice, son? Write her out of your life. Because I'm damn sure she's written us out of hers. No, no, no. Maybe. Your message said you were going to London. Casual trip? Or is this tied to the new dream? I'm, uh, meeting with the Santo group, Nathaniel Brown and his investors. Santo? They built the Udalek complex, the Og Ghetto, here in Prague. Why are you meeting with them? Brown's got big plans. He wants to focus on real solutions, ideas that look to the future. Y you've heard of the Safe Harbor Initiative? I've heard of Rabia, the walled city he and his company are building in the desert for Augs. He is just a part of it. We're talking about self-sustaining, energy-efficient arcologies that can be replicated anywhere on Earth. Cities built by the Augmented, for the Augmented. Where the dream of self-controlled human evolution lives on. It may not seem like it right now, son, but one day, people will move on from the incident. And when that happens, we'll be ready for it. I'm glad we caught up, Adam. I've always tried to look out for you, you know. That bombing yesterday. You didn't call to talk about the bombing. Just ask. It's nothing, really. I, I just need a signature so I can finish filing the bankruptcy paperwork. You need my signature? Yeah, apparently there was some kind of bureaucratic mix-up caused by you being declared legally dead for a year. The apartment in Detroit was leased in your name, even though we paid for it. Fine. Send me the paperwork. Thanks, Adam. I appreciate it, really. Goodbye, Seraph. Uh, well, Jensen. It's good to finally hear from you, Agent. You doing okay? Sorry about the downtime. I'll get to the office as soon as I can, but my Augs took a hit during the attack. I need to get them looked at. 
Of course. There's a lot of work ahead of us, Jensen. I'll see you when you get in. Dr. Kohler, I need to pay you a visit. Jensen! Now's actually a really good time for me, like right now! Something wrong? There are some guys in my bookshop. Oh, Pissed off the valley oh. gangster looking guys. So, unless you want bloodshed the day after a terror attack. The front door isn't the most peaceful option. I got it. This is my third scan this week. Why don't you scan somebody else? Fine. Put it to soap on your butt, you will have no blame, These hands are on thin fucking eyes. Nothing suspicious. You, stop right there. Yeah, you, down on your knees. Hands behind your head. About your permit, Doc. Doc Larry, Doc Larry, show me latest papers. Otherwise, you cannot go through. I know the drill. The drill has changed. <coughs> Too many forgeries. All Ogs must now carry a supplementary permit authentication card. Do you have this card? My documentation's never been a problem before. It's not about to become one now. You sure about this? I am policeman. You see uniform. You see gun. You know, now that you mention it, your setup looks a little odd. Budget cuts? No need to insult us. Times are difficult for a regional document checking police. But fact remains. If you continue this way without newest permit, I am legally obliged to shoot you. Is that right? My friend, I know what you're thinking. It's terrible the way they make laws against your kind. But listen, uh, maybe I can do something to help. We could come to an understanding. What kind of understanding? Lucky for you, I know a guy. An expert in... Uh, permitification. A document agent. He offers permits, authentication cards. Peace of mind. With his help, you go wherever you want, whenever you want, no more hassles. What do you say? Supposing I wanted to pass through here right now, before getting this special document of yours. Any way for me to do that? Sure. I suggest our pay-and-go plan. It consists of you paying me, and then me letting you go. You mean bribery? Wink, wink, my friend. I prefer the term standard fine. Tell you what. I'll even give you the good citizen discount. Just this once. This document agent you mentioned, you see the one in charge? He gets you to stop Ogs and offer them this opportunity to do business with him. Go see for yourself. My friend has documents to pass checkpoints, to keep police off your back, to get into parts of Prague you never knew existed. Tell him Drahumir sent you. You'll see. I give you address, yes? All right, give me the address. I think I'd like to see who's behind all this. Chekashka. There is a courtyard behind the apartment building. Very easy to find. My friend will be there. He will get you latest permit card. <coughs> Just pay him and don't ask questions. Pirates. Whatever. I saw him yeah. last night. You know what I fucking meant. Leave me alone, you fascist! Move along, everyone. Nothing to see.
They were like creatures that hang around the airport. Church key card. What the? Is it, this is this is a fucking church. Jeez, church I've ever seen. Well, fuck. I thought that was actually good. One. I cannot wait for this district to be turned into cars. <coughs> Street is off limits, Oyobok. Private function. All businesses are temporarily closed. What the what the fuck just happened to smoke grenade? Oh uh, yeah, no, give me a fucking panic, but it didn't give him a fight.
Thank God! I'm down in the dungeon, man. You remember the title of my super secret book, right? I remember it's red. My favorite techno wonder kind. Sorry about the goons, man. They, uh, they didn't give you too much trouble, did they? They're not gonna be a problem anymore. What did they want? You behind on your protection money? I... I don't think it's about money. I got this little misunderstanding with their boss, Otar. You know how it is with these gangster types. Enough to know that there's no such thing as a little misunderstanding. The Valley internal politics. I... I'm gonna get it sorted. Gonna see the big boss myself. As soon as things settle down. The day after a bombing, man, it's... Well, I mean, it's scary, right? I'm surprised people go out at all. Sometimes people don't have a choice. My systems took a hit. I was hoping you could help me get everything running again. Took a hit? You mean... Oh, shit! Why didn't you say so? We need to get you in the chair. The chair. You know I've always wanted to get a closer look at those sad fogs of yours. A real close look. So, uh... So let's strap you in, get the gas going, and then... Well, then I just need to sort of dive in. Uh, feel my way around. What exactly are you gonna do to me? I'm not sure yet. First, I gotta get in there to see what's wrong, but don't worry. I'm not gonna do anything to you I wouldn't do to myself. I promise. Besides, you've been here a few times, you know I'm professional. You've never had to put me under before. I never saw you the day after an explosion before either. That was a big shock to your system, man. Kaboom! Now, you want me to fix you or not? If... All right, let's just get this over with. Relax, Jensen. It's... it's gonna be fine. You... you won't even know I'm in there. You'll feel weightless, far away, like you're someone else. But Kohler's gonna bring you back and make you you again. Before you know it.
Oh, oh yeah, things have been falling up, falling up on this house all the, for like the past week. It's been... I nearly died twice on a Friday, just to let you know. Because like, there, there's, like, there were like three trees around my house, and there was a storm on Friday, all three of them fell. And like, the guy had to come in, come in and clear them away. And like, Fix said there was like a fucking force field around the house that the only, that the only damage caused was like a small dent in the roof. 